Hi everyone, this is M and welcome to my channel. Today, I'm going to share with you how to remove background using Canva on mobile phones and tablets. Before anything else, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let's start! To do this, make sure that you have your Canva app in your phone or tablet. And also, dapat naka-login kayo sa inyong Canva account. So, let us start by simply clicking your Canva app. Then, log in to your Canva account. So, ako, naka-login ako, kaya mabilis na lang, diretso na lang. Then, choose a template. So, for this video, I chose a blank poster template. Para kitang-kita talaga yung effect. Then, dapat meron ka nang naka-ready na picture. So, kung available siya sa ating Canva app, mas maganda. Pag hindi, pwede tayong pumunta sa upload and then click the upload media and then choose the photo library. Click the picture that you will use. Click add. So, dito mag a upload yun. Pag na-upload na natin totally, pwede na natin i-click para magamit natin as photo or image na gagamitin natin. Ang cute niya, di ba? Ayan, so meron na tayo ditong cat. Ngayon, ayoko yung background. Gusto ko yung cat lang. So, ang gagawin natin ay pupunta tayo dun sa bandang baba and then you will click the word effects. Then, lalabas yung background remover. Ayan. So, i-click mo lang yun. And then, tada! Wala na siyang background. So, pwedeng-pwede na natin magamit ng walang background. And, if gusto ninyong ayusin yung color, pwede nating i-filter. So, nandyan, katabi lang ng effects. And, kapag gusto naman natin ng background or additional background para sa likod, pwede natin i-click yung replace or pwede natin i-click yung plus sign at pumunta tayo sa photo or sa backgrounds para piliin kung ano man yung gusto natin bagong background. Then, continue lang. I-edit lang natin siya. Make sure na nasa harapan yung mismo ating image. So, yung position niya, make sure na naka-forward. Nandun din yung sa baba. Makikita niya rin na sa baba. Pwede rin natin i-resize or pwede rin natin lagyan ng text. And then, kapag okay ka na, all we have to do is to download. We will download this as an image. So, i-click lang natin yung arrow down sa taas. Then, para ma-check kung na-download natin, all we have to do is to go to photo or photo library or gallery or album. And yes, nandun na siya. Naka-save na. Pwedeng pwede na natin gamitin. If you find this video helpful, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Feel free to comment down below if you have questions or suggestions. I would love to hear them. Happy editing!